Hey guys, today I wanted to film a collective haul. Haul. Um, it's not all beauty stuff. I just kind of, just kind of everything. I have beauty, then tea, and then other things. A T-shirt. Yeah. Hope you guys enjoy. Peace. I'll start off with makeup, and then I'll head to something else. I got all my makeup here. Sorry if the lighting's not good. It's like 7.30. What time is it? Ah, 7.25. And I'm filming and the sun is sitting. So I'm going to hurry up and do this. Okay, this one doesn't have packaging. I lost it. It's just a paint pot and it's soft ochre. Um, I heard that this is going to be better than painterly for my skin tone. But honestly, I like painterly. I think it's more paler and better for me. I'm just going to go in a new random order. Um, then I got this blush in Well Dressed. And it's just a light pink blush. I use this in my Get Ready video. And it's just a nice cute blush. And I think it's cute for spring. And it matches my room. Room. I got this MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in the color Soft and Gentle. Um, everyone talks about this. So I thought I would give it a shot. I think it's super pretty. Super pretty. What a nice shine. Mac lip glass. Lip glass in Viva Glam Nikki 2. And it's purple. And it's her second one. Ten cents. Viva Glam 2. This is super fast. I feel a little cray cray. Mac brush. I got a Mac brush. Um, Mac 109. It's great for contouring. Them cheeks. Them chiquitos. Chiquitos. Do you say cheeks in Spanish? And next from NARS, I got this eyeliner, larger than life long wearing eyeliner, and it is in I cannot say this, Rue Bonaparte Parte 8056, and it's just this nude eyeliner. I saw that Gibson girl use this, and I thought I'd give it a try. I tried out this morning. You guys will not see that. Tried out this morning and I it was horrible. Horrible. And I saw one from Rimmel, like exactly the same thing for $4.99. This was like $24. So maybe I'll just return that and get the Rimmel one. And then from Sephora, got the Urban Decay Naked Basics. And as you guys know, this is a all matte palette, but one of them is satin finish, which is I think Venus, yes. And it looks like this. It's so cute and compact. <sighs> It's really hard to open though. And then it just looks like this. I think it's very nice. On the goo. And these are really pigmented matte eyeshadows. These are the MAC ones. Those are like beyond pigmented. And then I just got this free, <laughs> it's not in there, but it's a free Urban Decay um, eyeshadow primer. Moving on to drugstore. I got three makeup products. And the first thing I got, I don't have the packaging, it's out there. It's the um, Maybelline Baby Lips in the color Twinkle. And it's super cute. And it smells really good. It's just a nice pink color. I have it on right now, but obviously it's not gonna... Really moisturizing. Then I got this CoverGirl eyeshadow quad in Country Woods. And I'll open this up for you guys. It's winty outside. If you open this... And I think it was really pretty. In a way, it kind of reminds me of the Naked Basics palette, but a shimmery version. It just looks like that in there. Shimmery and cute, but in a way, it kind of bothers me <laughs> that it's not lightest to darkest, but whatevs. It is what it is. And then I needed a new eye makeup remover. And I just got the new Maybelline Clean Express one. I heard it was really good. Doesn't smell bad. Then I got this tank top. Tank top. And it's just like this. And it's just like a muscle tank. It's just a really baggy, long muscle tank that I got from super long from Nordstrom BP. And it was only $20. That wasn't bad. And I just like basic pieces like this. Because you 
can wear with any. And then I got this facial revealing peel off mask and I just wanted a mask. I wonder how this smells. Mmm, this smells really good. It smells like pomegranates. It does smell really good. Ooh. Then I got this fruit tea sampler. I'm kind of a little addict when it comes to tea. I love tea. I love trying out new teas. And I thought that'd be kind of yummy. There's raspberry zinger, country peach passion, wild berry zinger, true berry, and black cherry berry. And there is 18 tea bags. So I thought I'd try out this because I heard this one girl talking about it. Oh, Nikki Philippi. Then the exciting part. I got tea from Tea Vanna or Vanna. I got this thermos and it's green and you guys haven't seen this before. It just opens up like this. It's a little thermos and then you just put your little tea in here and that's all. I just got it in green and then I'm pretty I'm really excited to take this to school. I don't know why I just am. So I got that. I'm knocking everything over. Whatevs. Whatevs. Next, the exciting part. Tea. Tea. I got some tea vanna tea. And I think this packaging of this is super cute. It looks like Japanese art. Japanese art. Looks so cute. It looks really cute. And I like chai oolong. Maharaja <laughs> Chai Oolong and Samurai Samurai Chai Mate Mate <laughs> Whatevs And then Oh I love this tea so much I really like chai tea Oolong tea Green tea I like the Spicy weird yummy teas And I'll show you what it looks like I know it looks so yummy And Smells yummy too. And I'm excited to drink some tomorrow morning. Last, the last thing I purchased was, why is it blinking? Um, the last thing I got is this perfect tea measure. Or, perfect tea requires perfect proportions. And it's just this little spoon. It's this just a little spoon. And it was $3.99, not bad. I know I have a spoon here, but decided to get this to get a more precise. Quite heavy. Looks like a little baby spoon. I'm done with this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you drop the spoon. I hope you guys enjoyed this little collective haul. Um. Remember, collective means I did not purchase all this at once. Well, kind of half of it, but like the higher end makeup was like two weeks. And I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will talk to you guys later. Whoever watched this, okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs>